lot of times people look at the arts and separate that from the maths um, and sciences as two separate entities. But I think to make a strong organization to support your arts, it's critical that you utilize math and science. We realize that there is a crucial element to the arts that is rooted in these other forms that we have to harness to make sure we're utilizing it to make our organizations very strong. My name is Dwayne Reeder. I'm the founder of the Clemente Museum. I help put it together, keep it running, do all the stuff behind the scenes. It started with an archive, so I, I started as the Clemente family archivist. I know that if we are going to try to reach out to the younger people today, we got to be a little more progressive, a little more hip. When we saw the students get that excited, we knew that it wouldn't be a boring project. We knew that they would kind of really get into it. We're so busy here and we're so, uh, you know, our staff is small. We don't have time to go do all that research. So we've got to pay the mortgage and the bills first to keep Roberto alive. The information that they're going to be, you know, handed over to us is it's priceless. I mean, there's no way we could ever do that on our own. The museum was kind of organically put together. It wasn't something that uh, happened over time. It was one day there was no museum and then there was. That goes back to the family of Roberto Clemente having all these items that were of value to him as a humanitarian and as a baseball player and not really knowing how to preserve them or how to archive them. I had visited the Roberto Clemente Museum once before and I was just uh, enamored by the, the number of things that I could learn about Roberto Clemente. Uh, and recognizing that our systems team had the opportunity to create an impact with not only a small organization but something that I had uh, increasing passion in was something I really wanted to do and something that I really strive to uh, bring all of, all of the things that I've learned here at Heinz College to the table. We did a lot of research looking at small single athlete museums. It was really fascinating to see like the different kinds of organizations, like what exactly they do. I mean, I did not know like how vast and varied the field of sports museums were. And it was an incredibly eye-opening experience. My primary contribution to this project um, was looking at some of the numbers, looking at the statistics and the economics of how the Roberto Clemente Museum fits within the Pittsburgh region and how it compares to other organizations, whether that would be other single athlete sports museums or just Pittsburgh-based museums. I was able to analyze these organizations' finances and create conclusions that we used to help the Clemente Museum reach their fullest potential. My role is, first of all, we, I have to do a lot of research work since we have to do some case study for the museum, gather a lot of data from other organizations, and then that's the useful tool to analyze and get some real suggestion. Coming into Heinz offers me the opportunity to work with a team. Uh, the systems project especially, I, it's a collaborative approach. People are adding different things to the table, bringing different challenges, um, and identifying things that I wouldn't have thought of on my own. And it's a learning experience. I've learned a lot from my teammates, and I think that that was probably the most rewarding aspect of the project. The students were, were unbelievable. I mean, I hate to even say the word student because they're beyond students. I mean, these kids are, they are on their way. They are, they're geniuses. And there was a couple baseball nuts in that group. They really got into it and did an incredible job. It moved me. I was like, wow, this is just amazing. As a group, they just, you know, stepped up to the plate and they hit it out of the park. The toolkit is gonna have everything kind of laid out. We kind of briefly touched on it in the presentation. Everything that they're saying, we were already like writing notes down. The great thing is, is all the, the data that they're going to have, all the um, information on museums that you kind of compete with us and museums that we're similar to. A lot of good information that we're going to be able to use on just our, our pricing structure. I mean, a little bit, of, you know, in, in each category, we're going to be able to pull some things out of that toolkit and utilize it. We're very pleased on all the work that they did. We're really going to dive into that and really start implementing some of that stuff at the museum here. My number one goal is to keep Clemente burning through the, the young kids now, making his name just like grow and grow and grow. I mean, it was literally a dream come true. Thank God we did it, and man, are they, are they awesome. Really going to help the museum.